It's the Silver Shroud. Hello, and welcome back to Fallout 4. We've been doing the Silver Shroud quest line. Uh, just trying to get that done before we go back to finishing up the main original storyline. At this point, we've progressed to the part where we're kind of killing members of a rival faction to the mayor. Uh, we have one dude that's over here that we have to kill and another one over here that maybe we have to kill. But it looks like this one over here is going to be pretty easy to get to because we can just fast travel right to that. So we have to kill these dudes and then there's another guy, another main guy that we have to uh, try to kill because the mayor of Good Neighbor wants us to take him out because he's a rival and could be a danger later on. So that's the story. That's the that's the situation that we're in right now. But we need to travel over here kill one posse of people that's trying to that's actually out trying looking for us trying to kill us because we've been dispensing justice and they, and they don't like it oh that's probably them right there are they bad guys oh i'm not getting the yep that's her okay And that would be it for them. I'll take their stim packs. Why not? Okay. And then the other person we have to go get is way over there. So, I mean, I guess at this point, I just gotta, we just got to kind of hoof it over there. So, uh, in the spirit of saving you guys some time, I will cut to when we're ready to go. Oh, maybe not. No more hiding for you. Ugh, he keeps moving side to side. Stop it. After all. Man, I'm getting low on ammo here. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Oh. Of course, he freaking, as soon as I use my ability. up there. What is he doing? There we go. Ow. Is he rocket is he shooting a rocket launcher at me? Is that what that is? Okay. Are they all done now? Or sorry, I was trying to do that. Uh so I think what I'm gonna do is is I'm gonna take a second we'll come over here in a second, but I really need to restock on ammo so i'm gonna visit a couple of markets and just expend some caps so i'll be back when i'm done with all of that and we're ready to take out the next guy okay we got some more ammo for our rifle for our uh, energy weapons and we're making our way over here which you know should be relatively quick figured i'd bring you back now because we're in the middle of a storm so that's fun Hop over this way, find these guys, and ideally... So we left our 
things. Uh, find Kent. I told Kent all that hero stuff was going to get you she both killed. Friend alive, Shroud. Oh, God. Meet me at oh, Milton God. General Hospital. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. Save yourself. Okay. Well. Easy. I'm here now. Oh, Tell me what happened. It was terrible. Oh, a dozen raiders. They just charged in and grabbed Kent when they took him. Sure. Okay, yeah, we listened to the message already. We need to go to a hospital. Reign of terror is over. She won't be. Yo, let's turn that off. Hop back outside and we'll figure out where we need to go. We'll try to go rescue Kent. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. I've never completed a playthrough where I actually saved him. The conditions at the end where it's at the where, where you have to try to catch him, it's very difficult. So they want me to go down to. Oh. Kill Sinjin. Oh, hold on. Ah, oh, oh my God. Huh, okay. Uh, so yeah, we gotta kill Sinjin at the hospital there, but apparently we leveled up again. Did we? No, we did. Okay, I don't think there's anything I'm really specifically salivating after except for the pain train, so let's go ahead and take that. So now, when I charge into people, it hurts them and staggers them, so... Anytime I charge at them, they're going to take some serious, well, relatively serious damage. So we're going back into the hospital that we just came from to get the the electromagnet, electromagnets that we needed for the Liberty Prime. So that's kind of funny. We're going all the way back to where we just came from not two or three episodes ago. But that's okay. Um, uh, um, 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 over here. Okay. don't know what's going on over there and I don't want to know <laughs> we're trying to get through this we're trying to finish out this silver shroud storyline so we can basically tie up all the loose ends that we've had before we move on and finish the main storyline hmm. hey. uh, so ah! nice I'm gonna use more energy charging in like that but I have plenty of fusion cores, and I'm not all that worried about it. So I think I basically had to go all the way back through like I did before. So at this point, we have the Tesla armor upgrade. We have the Tesla armor upgrade and the pain train perk and massive damage and the uh, hit multiple people with our melee weapon perk. So we are a melee menace at this point. Who's there? Oh, 
Whoosh. What's going on over here? I always have to... Mm, we came in here, right? And then, oh, wasn't there a, there was a hole in the floor somewhere we had to drop down? One of these had a hole in the floor. I thought. Mm, am I just remembering incorrectly? Yeah. Oh, okay. There's a hole. I, like, I knew there was a hole. We dropped down here in a hole. It was like two episodes ago. Pick up all the stim packs I can, because all this melee combat is going to cause damage. I'm going to have to repair my armor at some, at some point in the near future, too. No, you don't. So the careful thing I the, the thing I need to be careful about is, is that when we get to the boss, I can't have this weapon out. I'm going to need... Okay, hold on. Trump, I want to talk with you. Okay, so I'm gonna quick save here. I'm gonna pull out my rifle. Well, and then I'll quick save here, because. It, I didn't get done what I was trying to do. Let's try that again. I gotta... You gotta kill the main guy before... I think that's the first time I've ever actually successfully finished that. <laughs> Finally, and the only reason I was able to do that is because I had the bullet time, that, and that allowed me to pump a bunch of rounds into this guy before he was able to really do anything. Kent. I've never been so happy to see anyone in my entire life. Are you all right? My leg is killing me, but it could have been so much worse. I just give up on all of it. Crime fighting just isn't what I thought it'd be. If you just quit, then the bad guys have already won. You... you're right. But I'm tired. I just want to go home. I'm going back to good neighbor. Really, thanks for saving me. But I'm just done. Okay. I don't think any of these guys are going to have anything particularly interesting on them, but that's okay. Mostly I just wanted to do that storyline so that you guys could at least see what it was. And it was a little bit, I know it's a little bit ridiculous. It's cheesy, whatever. I'm not usually into cheesy stuff, but it was an interesting little storyline that had a little bit of a, a cool thing for it. So we just need to go back and talk to Hancock and that will finish all of this out. Is there an exit out this way? I want to say that there was another way out of here. It did not require going all the way back upstairs. But I don't think so. Oh well. Oh, but we came in here before. I just need time to recover, you know? We came in here before for the electromagnet, so that's okay. It's kind of cheesy that they reuse the same spot for two different quests. <laughs> A nuka call a quantum there. So I believe I can just drop down here and then exits over here. Here we go. Oh, and there you are. So as you can see, we're pretty terrifying in melee capacity. Well, in pretty much every capacity at this point. Our power armor is super strong, and we're able to charge into battle, to, uh, knock people over. Smash, smash multiple people at the same time with our hammer, and it's just, yeah, it's pretty fun. So now we need to go back to Good Neighbor. Um, so we'll go there. We'll talk to Hancock in the Silver Shroud costume, 
And then after that, we can sell it because there's no more utility for it after that. I should look at the hat, though. I don't remember what the hat gives you. Uh, we're getting pretty close to the end of the original story. And then we have all the Far Harbor stuff to do. Okay, so I'm supposed to do this as the Silver Shroud, so let's go and do that. You ever tried the deed is done. The dreaded Sinjin breathes no more. All by your lonesome, you took down the big bad Sinjin. We get to walk that tightrope of freedom one more day. This for the effort. Much obliged. Ah, Ken, my man. Why the long face? You got what you wanted. I was t tortured. Almost died. It's not like the radio plays at all. Hey, who hasn't Duh. been tortured from time <laughs> to time? The price of throwing down with the man is always a few scars. Pick yourself up. Good neighbors just a bit safer thanks to the two of you. Hancock's right. But still, it's better to stay out of the action. You don't need to tell me that twice. I'm gonna need some time to heal, you know? But then I got a special project in mind, just for you. I'll fire up my radio station if I make any progress. Oh, okay. I guess we get to do... I guess there's some other things that can happen. It's just the odds of saving him, regardless of how strong you are, are so small. Because as soon as you become aggressive, he blows the back of his, his brains out. So <laughs> I don't think I've ever finished it. I, maybe I finished it once, but I don't remember ever finishing that quest in actual put my other armor back on. <laughs> I don't recall ever having actually finished that quest line with him surviving. So, yeah. So the Silver Shroud hat, yeah, just gives us perception. So, we're, yeah, we're going to sell all of that. But anyways, we need to go back to the Brotherhood of Steel quest line now so that we can finish getting Liberty Prime ready to go. So let's see what we need to do for that. Liberty Reprime, we need to speak, describe Halen. So let's uh, let's get ourselves back outside so we can quick travel back to wherever Scribe Halen is supposed to be. Outside the door here. And then we'll do that. And here we are at Waypoint Echo. I forgot that the, the, uh, the little sidetrack Silver Shroud thing made me forget that we. Oh, yeah, we're supposed to be going back into the glowing sea. So let's talk to Scribe Halen here. It's good to see you again, Knight. You've come a long way since you stumbled into Cambridge Police Station. Thanks, Halen. I assume the place is still in one piece. We're doing the best that we can. We've had the occasional synth attack, but so far we've been able to keep them from overrunning us. Thanks to the reinforcements and the air support, I'd say that site was secure. That's not surprising. After all, it's in good hands. I appreciate that. Anyway, I know you don't have time for small talk, so I'll get right to it. I've had the men set up the equipment we'll need to pinpoint you once you've found the bombs. We've rigged up this distress pulser to emit a unique tone that we'll be listening for. When you find the bombs, plant the pulser, and we'll handle the rest. After that, you should probably head back to Proctor Ingram and bring her your... Okay, there we go. Doesn't sound too difficult. Ah, uh, no, not at all. You're only heading back into the most inhospitable place in the entire Commonwealth. Look, I know you've been through the Glowing Sea before, but remember to keep an eye on your Geiger counter. If you don't, the radiation will cook you from the inside out. Good luck, Knight. Okay, so we have to locate the bomb facility, which is... Oh, it's way over here, too. It's not even close. So I guess we'll go to... Either way, we're going to have to go a little ways, but I think... Going to the rocky cave over here and then heading in that direction is probably our best bet. So let's do that. We'll get over there and, uh, yeah. These do our thing. Hopefully we don't run into too much on the way over there and we're able to quickly get inside and away from all the radiation.
How far away is it? Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and cut and we'll be back when I'm ready. Okay, so as you can see, I did make my way over to the site where we need to do that, but then I got a notification that says we need to check on Virgil, so we're back here. Uh, in the interim, I did fast travel back to Sanctuary to repair my armor because I realized I had taken a bunch of damage so far, and I didn't want to go into this site where there's probably a bunch of things I'm going to have to fight and have my armor pieces fall off because they're damaged, so... Between in the break, I took care of the armor situation and then fast traveled back here so we can go talk to Virgil and find out what's going on. Oh, okay. He Welcome definitely back. looks different. It needs some refinement, but uh, I think we can consider my serum a qualified success. This is incredible. It is a significant first step, but it still only works on one strain of FEV. It will take years, perhaps decades, to generalize my formula. Still, you have my gratitude. How is he not being cooked here? My lab. Or help yourself to any of this junk. In the meantime, I have a lot of experiments to run. Excuse me. So, was that it? Okay. <laughs> Talk to Bobby. Well, at some point, we'll try to remember to do that. But, okay. I mean, is, is, does this cave provide him with protection from the radiation? Or is the serum providing him protection from the radiation? Or does he have some kind of latent protection from the radiation? I'm confused as to why he's able to just be a normal dude and... This isn't, he's not being cooked alive. I don't know if that's an incongruency or if there's some explanation for it. They didn't provide one. But anyways, we need to go over here to the Sentinel site where we are going to find a bunch of nuclear weapons. But that being said, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode. Leave it on this little cliffhanger to find out what happens next. Hopefully you guys are having lots of fun. Be sure to click the like button so the YouTube algorithm knows that you are. And subscribe uh, and click the subscribe and push the video out to more viewers. Sorry, I'm screwing up my exit here. Boo. Uh, if you're not subscribed, please be sure to do that now so you know when the next video comes out. And I do have a link to my Patreon in the description description if you'd like to help me turn this channel into a thriving online business i'm looking for ideas for exclusive content that i can create for people who want to support my channel uh, so be sure to leave ideas in the comments section so i can put together a list and decide which one i'm going to do again hopefully you're having fun i uh, hope to see you for the next one and i will see you then bye guys